Two years have passed since Burma's pledge to release all children from military service. In a 2012 deal between Naypyidaw and the United Nations Children's Fund, all underage recruits were to be reunited with their families. Yet the Burmese army is continuing to hold children, despite some being able to prove that they were recruited under the age of 18. On the 1st of August, the Burmese government released 91 children, sparking congratulations from UNICEF, which said that the release indicated Burma's commitment to international law. Yet the piecemeal release of coerced child recruits is doing little to relieve the heartache for parents still missing their boys. <laughs> The Burmese government's pledge also covers those who have come of age while serving in the army. For those young persons, bureaucratic stumbling blocks are keeping them from returning home. Uh, and as the Burmese government stalls on the release of children currently serving, more are being forced into the ranks. The International Labor Organization believes that around 50 children have been forcibly recruited since 2013. Without recruitment reform, accountability, and monitoring, children may continue to be stolen from temples and markets or tricked into the army by the promise of an education.